Forest Canopy from Woodland Scenics is an easy and economical way to create an entire forest for your layout. Hi, I'm Troy with Woodland Scenics. You can use Forest Canopy to model everything from an entire forest to thickets and shrubs. Forest Canopy is available in a variety of colors, which makes it easy to model a forest in any season. You can choose from light green, medium green, dark green, and autumn mix. Each package of Forest Canopy contains natural plant material, scenic cement, and coarse turf. You can save time by preparing all your pieces at once. Begin by breaking or cutting pieces of Forest Canopy to the desired height and density. Next, grab the scenic cement in a bowl. Scenic cement is an adhesive that dries with a clear matte finish. Shake your scenic cement well and then pour into a bowl. Take your pieces of forest canopy and dip them into the scenic cement, covering the underside as well. Shake gently to remove any excess adhesive. Next, sprinkle some coarse turf onto your natural plant material. Coarse turf will add texture and highlights to your trees. Once the coarse turf has been added, let it dry. You can set your trees upright in some scrap foam while they dry. Once your trees are dry, you're ready to start your forest. To create a forest, plant your trees densely on your layout. Plant your trees by drilling or poking a hole and placing a drop of scenic glue into the hole. I'm using a foam nail to poke the holes in our layout. Plant the tree and hold until the glue starts to set. You can give your trees extra height by adding small pieces of forest canopy and gluing them to your treetops. Our next step is, is to create smaller trees in the front, kind of like we have here. Um, we've been adding them here and they're all kind of tall, but we want some smaller ones here to kind of create some smaller saplings that are, are uh, at the front of our forest canopy. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to take this tree here, and obviously that's too tall, but I'm going to take this one limb here, break it off, and then also I'm going to shorten it. There we go. And then that'll be nice and short and I can put it right in front of all this. Push this in here. And I want to come down a little bit because I want it to be a shorter tree. And hold it there for a second. Okay, there we go. Smaller pieces of forest canopy can be used as undergrowth. Just tear off what you need and glue the pieces into place. Attach these small pieces of forest canopy with some scenic glue around the base of the trees and on the forest canopy floor to add realism. You can also create dead trees using the natural plant material. Strip your trees of foliage and break some of the upper limbs. Let broken limbs hang, lean them against the trunk, or place them on the ground. You can use additional colors of coarse turf and fine turf to create highlights and contrast. Use a scenic sprayer to mist some scenic cement over your finished forest canopy.
and then sprinkle some fine or coarse turf as desired. Forest Canopy makes it easy to create a realistic forest for your layout. For more information on Forest Canopy and other landscaping products, visit our website at woodlandscenics.com. Thanks for watching.